Tisch graduates, you made it. And you're fucked. Today, you have achieved something special, something only 92% of Americans your age will ever know, a college diploma. You now have a crushing advantage over 8% of the workforce. I'm talking about dropout losers like Bill Gates, Steve Jobs, and Mark Zuckerberg. Class of 2017, congratulations. You accomplished something I never could. If you can't do the little things right, you'll never be able to do the big things right. So if you want to change the world, start off by making your bed. On this day of triumphantly graduating, a new door is opening for you. A door to a lifetime of rejection. It's what graduates call the real world. It's inevitable. Yeah, you're fucked. It's tough out there, so be patient. Many of your children, you haven't seen them in four years. Well, now you're about to see them every day when they come out of the basement to tell you the Wi-Fi isn't working. If your child majored in fine arts or philosophy, you have good reason to be worried. The only place they are now really qualified to get a job is ancient Greece. One thing I can guarantee you, you will have to deal with ignorance, hatred, racism, foolishness, trifling folks. That may not seem fair, but life has never been completely fair. Nobody promised you a crystal stand. I didn't get the job. But here's the thing. I didn't quit. I walked out of there to prepare for the next audition, and the next audition, and the next audition. I prayed. And when I was 12 years old, he was let go from that safe job. And our family had to do whatever we could to survive. I learned many great lessons from my father, not the least of which was that you can fail at what you don't want. So you might as well take a chance on doing what you love. Remembering that you are going to die is the best way I know to avoid the trap of thinking you have something to lose. You are already naked, so don't waste it living someone else's life. I don't give a shit. Okay? You cannot let a fear of failure, or a fear of comparison, or a fear of judgment stop you from doing what's going to make you great. At the core, None of us were meant to be common. We were born to be comets, darting across space and time, leaving our mark as we crash into everything. Today, I tell you that whether you fear it or not, disappointment will come. The beauty is that through disappointment, you can gain clarity, and with clarity comes conviction and true originality. Let me tell you a secret. No one does when they begin. Ideas don't come out fully formed. They only become clear as you work on them. You just have to get started. Not easy, but clear. You have to keep working. It's that simple. Dad, I always told you I'd come back and get my degree. Yeah.